Hello everyone, my name is High Techman and welcome to another unboxing. We have a lot of boxes to unbox, as you can plainly see right here. Hello everyone, my name is High Techman. As you can see by this POV camera right here, that I have not, there was not an earlier shot that I made, that uh, we have a lot of unboxing to do here. We have almost two months, two months worth of unboxing that we have to do. By we, I mean me specifically, but you're probably wondering, why are you wearing glasses and a tie and a dress shirt? Well, I wear this all the time to work. And I just realized something is that I'm not working and I am done with work for today. I need to take this thing off because I just, I'm done. I had to unleash the inner gamer in me. My Mario shirts. <laughs> just remember kids, every good businessman is a gamer on the inside. Now the shackles of corporate America have come off of me. Let's get to some unboxings. I've been waiting so long for this. You have no idea. Anyways, so I'm gonna start off with the top one right here. We got our one up box. Now this, these are for a mixture of, I wanna say November and December. Um, I, I kind of had a lot of things happen to me and I'll get into that a lot later, but let's unbox the one up box. Woo! Oh, what the heck is that? <laughs> Look like a dog there for a second. Is that... oh my god, that's kind of gross. What the? <gasps> oh, this is this is a mini Chewy. It's a mini Chewy. That is so cool. <laughs> oh my good, because Star Wars came out, of course. Oh my, this must be the December. <gasps> He's got a little pouch. That is so cool. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Fangirling again. Again, POV camera here, so you guys can actually see little Chewy. Yeah, I'm gonna, we're gonna, that's what we're gonna call him. I'm gonna call him Little Chewy. I'm gonna put him on my mantle. Oh, this is so cool. All right, what else we got here? Oh, a shirt. What kind of way did we get this time? It's gotta be something Star Wars related, I'm sure. Whoa. Is that my neighbor, or my neighbor Totoro with Princess Leia and all them? That's cool, but they gave me a small? Why did they give me a small size? I'm a extra. I am not a small. Okay, I gotta talk to them about this. This is not right. But regardless, this is still cool. I am. I, I love it. What else we got? We got a lanyard. What is this? This is another lanyard for just a regular. I'm gonna move this out of the way here for a second because there's a lot of stuff on my desk. So we got a regular lanyard here. Nothing too fancy. I mean, just a regular. Just you know, you got the stormtroopers. You got Vader, Death Star, Tie whatever chewy all them this is this is cool i like this i might use this for my badge at work that would be cool all right what else we got here we've got a inf <laughs> an inflatable <laughs> an inflatable don't know don't you put dirty things comments i can hear the comments already don't think of those things my my channel used to be a really clean place where people could converse and now it's just a bunch of these jokes no all right what else did we get here we've got a oh that's cool like a little uh, i think that's rocket rocket the raccoon from um what's that movie that just came out with chris pratt um uh, it's not galaxy quest it's i don't even remember what it's called it's uh guardians of the galaxy there we go and <laughs> captain kirby that's kind of cool. I like that. It's like a little mini poster thing. I got to put that up in my cubicle. That's That'd be funny. So we've got Galaxy was the theme for the 1UP box. Really cool. I like it. Inflatable lightsaber sword. Uh, oh, so it is raccoon decals, what it says it is. Okay, so I'm going to put that to the side. And oh, we almost forgot the button or button, the pin. Uh, oh, that's cool. It's got Wally. I don't know if you can see that. I'm probably not. Anyways, up there. Actually, no. I have my POV camera, so now you can see. Uh, kind of. Uh, anyways, that's Wally for December. So this is what's de the December box. So put that to the side. And I think I'm gonna actually unbox the November one here while I'm we'll stay while I'm at it. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox November real quickly. And what do we get for November? I am so excited, so excited, so excited. We've got Flash, the Flash, another little plush doll there. That's cool. I'm gonna put him next to Chewy. So, what else? We've got here a Batman. It looks like one of those things that you put like on your car. I don't know. It looks like you know, like one of those things that like like you know how you have like those Disney you know Mickey Mouse with the ears and 
I think this is what this is, but I don't know. It must be... There's... There's something in there. You can hear it. I'm going to open this thing up real quick. Let's see what's in here. Oh, so it's just a complete bobble or a little, you know, chibi thingy. So you just put it together and it's like a two-piece thingy. So, uh, there. Something like that. Anyways, I'll put this to the side. That wasn't really as exciting as I was hoping it would be. So what do we have here? We have another t-shirt, which is, this time it's in the right size. <laughs> Over 9,000. <000. laughs> this is Superman. Vegeta, that's, that's so funny. I, this is hilarious. I love it. <laughs> what else we got here? We've got a Star Wars puzzle. Ooh, that's a 100 puzzle piece puzzle. I like puzzles. Not a lot of people do puzzles anymore. And I think that, you know, I think this would be a good one. Because I'll probably end up, like, putting duct tape to the back of the puzzles. Because I used to do that all the time. We put duct tape in the back of it and then frame it. Because people don't do that anymore. And, you know, that was a, it's a lost sport. Or lost sport. It's a lost art. Ooh, air freshener with Harley Quinn in there. Ooh, it's a nice little Harley Quinn air freshener right there. Anyways, so we've got a nice <laughs> Goku Dragon Ball Z uh, decal there. That's probably going to go on my car. <laughs> oh, goodness. And, of course, we have the 1-Up Box November. Uh, the theme is power. You can't really see that. I don't know. So there's POV. Anyways, so that was cool. Uh, it was okay. I mean, power being like, you know, Superman versus Batman and then Goku. And we all know who would win in a, in a uh, battle from Goku versus Superman, right? Right? Yeah. Don't, don't spoil it. Okay, um, the next one we have is the arcade block, but here's the thing. I only have arcade block for um, <coughs> November because these ship out every 25th of the month, which means that the 25th of December, i.e. Christmas, they weren't going to be able to ship it out. So it should be coming in for January's stuff. So just keep an eye out for that. That will be coming out next. So oh, without further ado, let's go ahead and get this guy open. I just love these shirts. These shirts are so cool. I mean, look at this. This is looks like a Wooly Wooly Yoshi World thing shirt. That'd be like an ugly sweater thing, I guess. But it's cool. I like it. Another shirt for the shirt collections. Anyway, so what we got is the ooh Uncharted Nathan Drake exclusive pop figure. That's that's pretty cool. I like that. That's. I'm going to put him next to uh, Doc Brown for the other pop figures I have. We've also got Angry Birds. What is this? Chewies? The, the, are they, oh, no, it's a figure. So it's like this little, like, you know, things that you take out of the packet. In fact, I'm going to open this and see what I get because I am an impatient person and I like to see what we got. So what did I get? What did I get? What, whoa. What was that? Is it, was that a piece of ham? That was a piece of ham. Look at that. That's a piece of ham. So this is a, oh, this is the little blackbirds that, um, I don't remember what they do. I think they explode at the end or something. So, yeah. I don't, I don't know how to put, oh, this is, it's a two-part thing you put together here, right? Something like that. And then it just, it does something. I don't know. I gotta look up the instruction manual. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, it's right here. So, Angry Birds, collect them all, I guess. I don't know. I don't really make sense. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. I always do. But like I said, Angry Bird stuff, eh, they're pretty cool. What do we got here? Uh, oh, the Master Cork. I like that. The, this is basically like for all you wine drinkers out there, this is like nerd wine stuff. So if you want to like cork your wine, for example, and you don't have a spare cork, you put this in it and it looks like the Master Sword. That is... That is way cool. I like that for all you Bruce drinkers out there. I'm saying. Anyways, we've got what else? Ooh, that's pretty. Arcade block key. So this is just a key. But what's a two? I don't see. Helmet key, nickel plated, made in China. Penny Royal Studio. I don't know what that is, but if somebody can leave a comment telling me what this is, it looks really cool, I will admit. Um, let's see here. The Last of Us, Space Invaders. This is just more memorabilia stuff. Ooh, hello. Halo 5 2016 calendar. Ooh, my. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and open this up right now because I kind of want to see what kind of things they have in store. 
for the Halo 5 calendar. So we've got, what do we got here? The nice little dual captain there or something. Well, that's kind of nice. Yeah, that's really nice. It's all the different layouts, is what it looks like, of the different areas or something. That's that's pretty cool. I like that. I think I'm gonna hang this up in my in my office. This will look really cool. People will be like walking like, oh, that is such a cool calendar. What is it? Halo 5? Whoa, where'd you get it? Loot crate or arcade block? It's like, oh, how can I just sign up? It's like you just sign up here and then I get a reference, I guess. Anyways. Um, so what else we got here? We've got the sh shirt, what? Shirt punch. It's just a coupon. And um, more uh, vinyl figure stuff, Nathan Drake, Fine Limited Edition, blah, blah, blah. I think that's everything in this crate. So that's that takes care of the arcade block. We only have one. Anyways, let me get the loot crate out. I'm pretty sure this one, I don't remember what this one is. I think this one is November, so we'll find out what. Oh, look at that. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Little Shogun glasses. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> Uh, oh, this is Nin Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles to be, um, what's it, uh, oh, Shredder. That's what it is, supposed to be Shredder. That's way cool. I like that. We <gasps> A Vault Boy bobblehead? <gasps> oh, my goodness. I'm just so fangirling out here. This is, oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay, so what is this? What is this? This is like Christmas for me. <gasps> Goodness, that is so cool! Look at that! That is so cool! It, it bobbles and everything! It's a bobblehead! A bobblehead! That is, that is, that is, that is way, that is definitely, definitely going in my office. There's gonna be so many people that walk by is like, oh, where'd you get that? A cute but deadly series one figures. I guess these are from it says Blizzard, so I think this is one of their new series of something. I don't know. I don't. I don't keep up with Blizzard products anymore. Ever since WoW, and there's a long back history with me and WoW, and it's not pretty, and I'd rather not go into it. So, <clears throat> what is this? Uh, this looks pretty foily. Foily, I guess, is the right word. Um, Bob just so excited about that little pit boy. In fact, you know what? This is the perfect op for a POV shot here. I'm just gonna see, look at that little pit boy. Little pit boy bobblehead. So cool. I love it. <laughs> okay, so let's stab this in the heart. And what do we get here? Oh God, that looks so horrible. Yeah, cool. It's like, it's like watching Code Lyoko again, only with big hair. Oh no, his hair. His hair fell off! That's gross. I'm gonna have to report that to Loot Crate or whatever. All right, I gotta clean this. This area, this this is way cool. The, the bobblehead, I'm still. <laughs> oh goodness, this is, this is so cool. All right, so what do we have next? We have Mockingjay. Oh, this is cool. Like a little, like not a brooch, but like one of those um, pins you put on your, like, you know, like, like a suit or something. So I'm gonna actually open this up here. This looks like official merchandise too. See, that, that's pretty cool. I like that. Ooh, that is pretty. You hear that? Yeah, I heard it too. <laughs> Thanks, video editing magic. I love you. <laughs> okay, so the Gift of Geek from Loot Crate. What is this? Uh, happy Holidays, Looter. At a Loot Crate, we try to make our crate special, blah, blah, blah. Share the love with your geeky friends and family. Re-gift your loot to someone who will love it. Much love. Oh, they actually included little tags. That's cool. See, if I would have known this, I would have unboxed it earlier. But there's a whole backstory of why I haven't been doing this lately, which I'll get into much later. And it looks like I got the cute but deadly wall fridge magnet thing. So I'll put this on my fridge. That's going to be a thing. And, ooh, a loot crate. What is this? Um, no, no, this is just all the stuff from loot crate as far as, you know, what they did, how they did it. All the different stuff. That's cool. I like Pokemon. I love Pokemon. Anyway, so that's just nothing really too fancy in here. And it's just blah, blah, blah. <gasps> Poop boy. Vault boy. All right. So let's go ahead and Street Fighter Hyper Loot. Hyper Looting. It's an actual comic book for Street Fighter. That's cool. I got a, um, I mean, I've got a bunch of comic books. I got to, you know, reorganize and all that stuff. But still, this loot crate was actually for the month of November so I was right so you can see there November and down there I don't know I just 
They're all pins. All right, now that we've cleaned up here a bit, let's get to the this big loot crate for the month of December. Ooh, I don't know what's happening. Ooh. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. That's They started off with a t-shirt, so that's already going to be good right there. Put that to the side. This looks... Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, Halo 5. This looks like something you'd use for ammo. That's... That's really cool, actually. I like that. Oh, everything came in that! That's way cool! Okay, before I go into this, then let me finish the box. So, uh, the box has Halo 5 out Guardians Supply Rec Pack for the Xbox One. I guess this is like a code if you have um, Halo 5, which I don't. I th oh, so this booklet for Loot Crate, now you need to off over here. This booklet for Loot Crate basically just goes over all the stuff that they've done for the past year with Loot Crate. So that's kind of cool. This is old back history stuff. And there's no pin in here. So let's go ahead and continue. This is way cool. I, li I like this. This looks really cool. All right, so let's go ahead and take one thing out at a time here. We have a Han Solo Snow Gear pop figure. So he's going to look good next to Chewie. Because we need Chewie. All right. Ooh! <laughs> oh my goodness! Why? 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 Uh, uh, this is uh, BB-8, the the new drone in Star Wars. Uh, is it BB-8? I think it's BB-8. I'm not sure. I am. Don't roast me, but I haven't seen the movie yet. Don't spoil it for me. Com comments. I'm looking at you. Don't you ruin. That's too late. You've already written it, haven't you? Anyways. Um, so yeah, that's cool. I like these socks. These socks look awesome. So let's go put that to the side. And that's practically it. Galaxy Quest emblem patch. <gasps> this is Galaxy Quest? Okay, for those of you that don't know or have never seen it, go on Netflix and watch Galaxy Quest if they have it on Netflix. I don't know. Find a copy of Galaxy Quest and watch it. If you're a Star Trek fan, you will love Galaxy Quest. Basically, it's Tim Allen acting as William Shatner and you've got like the whole, you know, uh, TOS, uh, uh, the original series uh, cast basically, you know, they're acting like the original cast and they're at a Star Trek convention and they, you know, not to give away too much of the movie, but they actually get abducted by real aliens and it's just, it's a good family movie. You should definitely watch it. And this is an official Galaxy Quest patch. This document certifies this prop replica of the Galaxy Quest emblem patch was created by Quantum Mechanics Incorporated under license from Paramount Pictures exclusively for Loot Crate. <gasps> oh, this, this is something that you put, you literally put this in a dark box or a black box, whatever it's called, even for, to display it. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna display this very properly. And of course your Loot Crate for December is Galaxy. That's what it says. I don't know if you can see that or not. Probably not. All right. So what we have two boxes left. <laughs> My goodness, we've been recording for almost. Tw I've been recording for 20 minutes now, just doing all this. But we have one more. We have two boxes left. The indie box. It'll be real quick. I hope. All right. So this one I'm thinking is November. Uh, yeah. I think this one's November's. So indie box challenge. Up for the challenge. Lift up this box. So we got a challenge here. Let's get creative, download, design, and submit. Okay, so this is stuff. But this is the game that they have, and they also have the Steam key in here too, so I'll keep that to the side here. This is Mermello. This is kind of cool, looks interesting. Let me get the plastic off of this guy real quickly, but. <clears throat> Anyways, going back to IndieBox's new design, it looks actually pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot. I mean, it's it's definitely an, an up, upgrade from what they had. So there's the game, the box. There's some of the sides there. And I remember there's a game of Grim Fairy Tale base, Grim Fairy Tale board game come to life, full of swag buckling adventure, combining deep tactical card play, rich tabletop strategy, and RPG elements. That sounds kind of interesting. So limited edition. Ooh, that's that's actually kind of cool. So yeah, that's the back. If in case you wanted to see the back there, or whatever. Anyway, so let's go ahead and open this guy up. Uh, ooh, this is a really really pretty little like you know pin again with the pins i don't know why people are always giving away pins but this is this is very beautiful i mean just look at that 
It almost looks like real gold and everything. It's it's beautiful. It's a collector's pin, but it's really nice. I like it. It's really pretty. We've got a patch. Well, it looks like a patch. I don't know. It's a patch. It looks like Griffin Girl. But whatever. Uh, we've got the game manual and more manual stuff. And the stickers, like always. The original soundtrack. That's kind of cool. Uh, what do we have here? Uh, retract. Oh, wow. That's cool. So these are like little, like, like you know, not swag bucks, but like you can hear the, the material. It's actually like those little, like you see... You see, we read this one way, and it turns into a different thing when you do it like this. See? Woo. So that's that one. You got your blacksmith card. Yeah. And then your evil eye card. That is way cool. I like that. That is really cool. These guys actually put a lot of work into this stuff. These are spell cards, retractable. Yeah, this is all cool stuff. All right, so what do we have here? What is this this last thing? This looks like a, like a flag or something. I don't know. Uh, is this a flag or a tote bag or something? This looks like a... Oh, yeah, this is like one of those um, like banners. I'll put that up with some more other things. And, of course, you've got the DRM-free version, which I love. So I'm going to go ahead and put this inside. Well, sorry about that. I kind of had a small camera malfunction there. It was a little crazy. Anyways, last box. The absolute last one. So let's go ahead and get this done. Because I need to get more videos pumped up. Because I am just super, super pumped about making videos again. I am really miss... I really do miss making videos. So, oh, okay. That's okay. Indie box challenge again. Okay, so we have another challenge thingy here. How to enter? Okay, we'll we'll do that in a minute. So we have here Freedom Planet. Looks like a little Japanese-based kind of game here. This looks kind of cool. Like a looks like kind of like a not Konami, but like a, a Sega kind of game. Yeah, that's what it looks like, anyways. But you know, who knows? Not Sega or whatever. But um, so you can see that's what it looks like. And there's the side right there, in the back. And this is actually kind of heavy kind of amazingly. All right, fight your way across the celestial world of Ava of Avalanche where cats and green motorcycles drive up walls and monster girls do most of the butt kicking. Freedom Planet is a cartoony combat-based platform adventure that pits Spunky Dragonoid and her friend against an alien attack force. That's kind of that's kind of sexy. Anyways, so let's go ahead and see what they put in. Wow, they put a lot of stuff in here. Let's All right. Whoa, what happened there? Oh, no! It looks like something broke! Did something break? I'm gonna be... <gasps> no! They did break! Oh, no! Why did they break it? Okay, first things first. That's a really cool-looking manual right there. I don't care who you are. That looks really cool. I like that. Second thing is Freedom Planet Stone. Uh, what is this? I guess this is a type of stone or something? I don't know. It looks kind of cool. It's like two colored metal and crystal. I got to play the game, I guess, to find out what it is. <clears throat> DRM free version. And oh, this is oh, this was like a coin thing. See, that's that's what this was supposed to be for. It's all right. Nobody saw that, right? Nobody saw that. Uh, Mayor Zhao. That's what it says. Mayor Zhao. I don't know who Mayor Zhao is. And it's plus five something. Plus five freedom planet. So I guess it's like points or something. Oh, the CDs. Official game soundtrack. It, they broke. I'm going to be... That's very disappointing. Look at that. I see it cracked. Oh, I just hope the CDs survived. Yeah, they survived. That's kind of cool, though. There's a lot of music in this game, I guess. This has like three CDs worth of music. So I'm going to go ahead and put that to the side. Hopefully, I guess I can get that fixed. I can fix that somehow. I'll figure out a way. And, of course, we've got the really cool-looking sticker there. I don't know if you can... That's a really cool-looking sticker. And that's it. That's... Yeah, we got some kind of... What looks like a... I want to say it's another flag thing, but I don't know. Uh, oh! No, this is a wallet! That's a wallet! That's... <laughs> oh, my goodness. There's so much stuff. This is, this is going to be so funny. Anyways, that was two months of unboxing. It came and it went very fast. Oh, goodness. So, thank you very much, everyone, for watching. If you liked that video, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe, and share the video with your friends. And as always, I will see you in the next video.